We're here at Longwood Festival, hosted by Councilmember Rafael Salamanca, who is in celebration of the Puerto Rican culture. So we have music, we have food, and you have, of course, the people. The Longwood community kicked off the summer in style as local officials and groups came together to host a festival for Bronx residents. We're here today on Longwood Avenue just celebrating the good weather and the beginning of the summer of 2023. Our constituents are looking for street festivities and we had them the last two years and it's great to have it again. Um, but it's, it's most importantly, it's great to bring these class acts to the community where they don't need to pay for them, like Puerto Rican power. Salsa and Merengue was played outdoors with live music guests like Kenito Mendez, Peter Natar and Associates, and the Puerto Rican Power Group. It's a pleasure for the Puerto Rican Power Group to participate in Longwood and in all New York, in all the festivals. We're on the order, they're our brothers, dear Americans, all the entire world. So it's a pleasure for the Puerto Rican Power Group, and we'll be soon here. And when it comes to moves, Mambo Salsa dancer Joshua Garcia not only knows about it, but talks about his culture and shows us some moves. For being Puerto Rican, I love having the food and I love being Puerto Rican, especially during the time of June because it's the Puerto Rican Day Parade and all the festivals such as 116 and all, all the side festivals as well. They're perfect. It's all about culture. Everything there from the parade to the 116 festival, all culture. Even the locals wanted to tell us more about being at the festival and what being Puerto Rican meant to them. I love all the activities over here. We love the Bronx people. Ocha Beach, everything else, El, El Condado de la Taiza. Soy de Puerto Rico de Carolina. Y me gusta el Sortial Nacional de la Salsa. Voy todos los años. Aquí el Bronx es best. Reporting for BronxNet, Chanel Thompson.